What's up guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. In today's video, we are reviewing two products from Roadrunner bags. We have the Burrito and a Bar bag and we have the tool roll that goes right behind the saddle. Let's have a look. So I discovered Roadrunner bags when I was in California last March. I went to their factory where they handmade all the bags that they produce and I got myself the tool roll for uh, my saddle bag. I had this really ugly saddle bag and when I changed it for the Roadrunner one, my style points went up like 100%. But when I had a flat about two months ago, I forgot my saddle bag on the ground. Um, and I just left and when I came back it wasn't there anymore so some lucky guy got himself a bunch of tools and a really nice bag so I reach out to them and say hey uh, I lost the bag I really like them are you down to collab and send me a new one and they were super down and they sent me three bags for a review all right let's talk about the burrito and by bar uh, I really like it it has a perfect form factor for those 100 to 200 kilometer rides. In there you can store a little camera, you can store your wallet, keys, a uh, bunch of gels, a bunch of food, energy bars, and it looks really nice. I like the fact that this bag is water resistant and the zipper and everything is heavy duty. Uh, this bag will last a, a lifetime. A thing you have to keep in mind, you cannot open it with one hand. So if you are riding, um, you need two hands on this little lever here to pull the zippers. Same thing from the other side. Uh, it's okay, you can do it while you're riding. Um, you just have to go on this top of your bar, you hold it, you open it, and then you close it. But I think it's a lot better for uh, when you have to stop and then you can have access to everything inside. Now let me show you what I got inside of this one. Um, so I got my keys, a camera, one, two gels, I have some electrolytes, my wallet, another gel, chocolate bar, and I even had some space for more stuff. Now let's have a deeper look at the saddle bag. As you can see, it has really nice style. It fits nicely behind any saddle. Its construction is perfect. It's water resistant again. You just have to be really careful with this clip. As you can see here, um, there's a double click. If you just uh, secure it to the first click, it might fall off with vibration uh, or when you're gonna hit a bump. But if you put it all the way down to the second click, there's no way you're gonna lose the, the saddle bag. Let's have a deeper look inside of how I set up my tool roll. So when you open it, you have access to this button that opens up and give you another access to those three compartments on each side of the saddle bag. So in the main one, that's how I set up it. I have uh, an extra tube, a CO2 cartridge, and I have the pump there so it fits inside and it's saving some space. On the side compartment, I have a multi-tool and some patches. Another cool thing about this bag is that you can remove the velcro that goes uh, over the seat tube and you can use it as a, like a gas station lock for your bike. Uh, it's super easy to do, you just tight and then you can leave your bike outside and uh, it's gonna give you this little assurance that no one's gonna just jump on your bike and leave with it. This is it for today's video. I would like to thank Esther from Roadrunner Bags for sending me the burrito and the tool, tool, tool roll. It's, it's a bit hard for me to say, uh, but thank you, Esther. Uh, the bikes are nice and I am uh, riding them every single day, pretty much. Uh, if you're interested in, in the bags, just go check out their Instagram or their website. They also have like a lot more bags uh, that goes like into the frame or uh, in their back and uh, a lot of stuff for like bike, bike packing, which I'm not really into yet uh, maybe when i get older um, <laughs> if you enjoyed this video don't forget to leave a thumbs up it's always really appreciated and subscribe if you aren't already I have a lot more cycling content coming in the next few weeks that you don't want to miss out all right my name is charles and i'll see you guys on the road or into the next video